Um, hello. This is Johnny D. John John Dickey. If you may know, I did my um VHS collection um video, which was three parts. Go back and watch those. Those are pretty good. Well, they got a lot of view. Well, they got some views. <laughs> they got some subscribers, and um. Yeah, so I'll be doing these updates on this channel, not on John Zombie 101, which is my second channel, because I don't have I'm have 98 videos and my 100th is going to be something special, so I need to wait until that's done. But um, yeah, this will be my um first of my updates. Um, got some pretty cool videos here. Most of them you already saw, but I'll go into more in depth of where I got them, who sent them, the conditions, stuff like that. So, I've got, let's see, 10 slipcases and 6 clamshells, 4 of which are big clamshells. So, this should be fun, or, you know, fun for me to look at my videos. Alright, these are my, sli I'm going to start with my slipcases first, they're in no particular order. The Odd Squad, mentioned this. This I got because it I not it's not horror. It's a like a screwball comedy about war and stuff. Looks pretty funny, got that great artwork. And I picked this up because it's number it's Star Maker number one. And I collect Star Maker. So if you actually have any Star Makers, please message me. I'll trade for them. And they're not too rare, so don't expect anything like, you know, anything rare for, for them, but you know, always looking for Star Maker. Mm, next, I have the Weirdo, which I mentioned. Got this from Based. Um, good condition. Um, started watching the movie, and I didn't really like it. I was pretty bored by it. But as it turns out, people do like it. Sorry, I'm kind of out of frame. People do really like this movie. So, got that great artwork. Those four people down there, up there. So, this is pretty cool. I'm glad to have it. Been looking for it for a while because it's Radon. Love Radon. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Next, I have Hellgate, and I finally got around to watching this movie, and I loved it. It's pretty stupid. The comedy is just, like, ridiculous, and it shouldn't be a comedy, but it is pretty fun. The effects are pretty cool sometimes. And, um, the music is pretty cool. Um, and... Mine is a little beat. I got in a trade for a uh, jug chord. Uh, jug, jug chord. That's it. Um, mm, trade some anchor blade. Yeah, anchor bay clamshells for it. Pretty cool. Hellgate. I'm sorry. I'm like just holding this up. The reason I'm doing this is because flips open and have that other artwork, which is really cool. I think that zombie's in the movie, so it's definitely not misleading. Sorry, my, um, I turned my fan off because it's a really big one. It has a lot of noise, just so you could hear me talk. Um, Faces of Death 5, mint condition, or near mint. Love that Gorgon video logo. Oh, I'm losing my voice. Uh, I believe at part 5 is when they stopped actually being movies and just turned into, like, compilations. Next one, Witch Doctor. Didn't talk about this too much, but, um... I know nothing about this movie. They're for sale for like 16 bucks on e um, on eBay, but I don't know. Like this one doesn't have a top flap, so at first I at first I thought it was a bootleg, but I don't think so. It's printed on good cardstock. It's got usually when there's bootlegs they um take the official poster and put that on the front, but this one looks that doesn't look like a bootleg. It just looks like really cheap production, homemade. Who knows? So that's Witch Doctor. Uh, if you have Witch Doctor and you know if that's a bootleg or not, please let me know. And also, if you have anything, or if you want that Witch Doctor, that's up for trade. But I'm keeping it in my uh, actual collection for now. In terms of the Living Dead, love this movie. Pick this up for free. Love it. Um, th this one's a little beat. The Return of the Living Dead. Next one, Don't Open Till Christmas. Um, got this in a trade. I'm not sure if this uh, kid has a YouTube channel. His name is um, Max Blackman. Um, he traded that I um, trade Redneck Zombies, the trauma tape, and um, no, nah, it's not rare at all. I mean, neither is this movie, but 
I saw it, and it's a little beat, beaten and faded. But I wish he had told me this, but I'm still happy to have it. Look at that. Not the camera. At that. All that mold. Ugh. But uh, hopefully I'm going to clean this off soon. I just got that from my Vestron collection. Next is the comic, which I am so happy to have this. This has been on my want list for a long time. Comic, great artwork. And it's still sealed. You know, original seal. So that's pretty cool. Next, of the last of the slipcase is uh, Ghoulies 2. Got this in a trade uh, with the, for... Um, I also got um, Faces of Death. So, two slipcases. Now, going on to small clamshells. Body Shock. Mention this. This is extremely rare. It's like one of those independent releases. Got for the artwork, but as it turns out, it's about piercings and stuff. Talked about that in the, um, up in the uh, collection videos where I said there's actually a man getting his penis pierced straight through. It's five minutes. Pretty brutal. I'm sending a, a DVD-R to my friend. Next, Cut Boogeyman. Don't like cut boxes, just pick this up because it was Wizard. Maybe I'll trade it, who knows. I am a fan of Wizard. If you have any Wizard tapes for trade, let me know. I'll take, mm, pick them up off you. I'll save that one for last. Now on the clamshells. Love this cover. Uh, Dr. Gore. I believe this is also the Body Shop. Really want that release, but this will work for now. Pretty great. I don't like that how they censored it, but still pretty funny. Um, Dr. Gore, United Home Video, happy to have it. I'm looking for more United. Next, love this artwork, uh, Brain of Blood, Clamshell. Got this in the trade for, um, for the Blob, I think. Got that from Earl Kess. Next, uh, Castle of the Walking Dead. I love this, um, Regal, Regal video. Love Regal Video. Um, that's a really early VHS. And last and definitely not least, biggest um, buy of this whole collection. Biggest, literally. Things VHS from Mondo Video. Not not a huge fan of Mondo. Mondo is a little not my favorite distributor. But a few things I don't like about this. It won't fit on my shelf. Uh, it's too big too. It won't fit on any of the shelves, and it's ten. It's not ten times bigger, but way bigger than any big box, which is stupid. But I do still love it. The uh, cover art, and two, they put the uh, insert upside down, so that's stupid. It falls. You take it out from the bottom. Not a big fan of that. But other than that, that's a cool tape. Really cool. And right now they're pretty rare. They sold out in, I think, five hours. Most Mondo releases are, because there's only 250 made. So, that's my update for this week. Um, hopefully, next month, I'll have another update up. Getting some cool tapes. And I will be making an update for just one video pretty soon. It's pretty cool. So, yeah. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to this channel, which is uh, Horror VHS Music. And also, subscribe to uh, John Zombie 101. Thanks for watching.